Where are they? I thought they'd be here by now. I know, they're taking forever. Oh, there's a car. Is that? Oh, no, it drove by. Hey, what are you guys doing? We're waiting for Uncle Amazon, John, and Lizzie to get here. That's Aunt Lizzie now. They're married, remember? Oh, yeah, and Auntie Lizzie. Oh, yeah, I forgot they were coming today. That's cool. Are they, like, staying at a hotel or something? Uh-uh. Dad said that they're staying with us. Yeah, we got a full house, Marcel. Uh, well, like, where are they going to sleep? That's the best part, Marcel. Yep, guess who's roommates? Mom! Mom! What's up, Marcel? Is everything okay? Uh, not really. Where's Uncle Amazon John and Aunt Lizzie staying? They're staying with us. Right, I forgot to tell you that, well, since we're running out of space, you're gonna have to stay with Johnny and Jasmine. <laughs> Told you, Marcel. Hey, roomie. Ugh. Marcel, wait, it's gonna be fun, I promise. Oh, I think I see a car pulling up. Maybe that's them. <gasps> it is! Yeah, Aunt Lizzie and Uncle Amazon John. Oh, yeah. Ricardo family, full house. Oh, oh, ah, ah. Don't miss any of our videos. Click the little monkey logo to go to our channel page. Click on videos to watch them all. Subscribe to our channel, it's free. Don't forget to check out our Instagram at little underscore monkey underscore media to leave a comment or suggestion for future videos. Hey John, good to see ya. I'm glad you guys made it safe and sound. What kind of explorers do you take us for if we get lost coming to your house? <laughs> this is true. <laughs> Aunt Lizzie, you look fantastic. Yeah, but there's something different about you. Did you cut your hair? No. Uh, did you, did you color your hair? Something's different about you. I just can't put my finger on it. Johnny, she's pregnant. Indeed I am. Ah, not another baby. Oh man, Christmas is gonna have so many people. Johnny, don't be rude. Having a baby is a blessing. Please don't pay any attention to him. No, not at all. It's all right, Lucy. Johnny's not wrong. The Ricardo family is it is a very large family indeed. Yeah, and did you know that Becky's pregnant too? What? She is? Fantastic! Oh, how lovely! Well, I hope that we'll get to see them for a visit as well. You will. They're actually staying with us. Whoa, what? Really? Yep, that's what I was trying to tell you on the phone yesterday, John. The doctors ordered Becky to stay in bed for a little bit, so we told them to move in so we could help them with the babies. Whoa, it is a full house. Oh no, John, maybe we should find a hotel. There's a lot of people here. I don't want to put you out, Lucy. It's no trouble at all. We're just so happy that you're here. But, uh, Rick, we can't put them in Marcel's room now. Marcel's mattress isn't very comfortable, and Lizzie definitely can't sleep on the couch. Well, there's nowhere else to put them. They can't sleep on the couch down here. There is the bathtub. I'll sleep in the bathtub. No one's sleeping in the bathtub, Johnny. Oh man, that would've been cool. There's no other place. There's only Marcel's room. Well, there is one more room. You're not thinking what I think you're thinking, are you? I think I am. <gasps> John, Lizzie, you guys can stay in our room. Oh, Rick, no, can't do that. That's your room, honestly. We'll get a hotel, it's fine. Yes, it's totally all right. I don't want to take your bedroom. No, it's already decided. You guys will take our room since Lizzie, you're pregnant and you definitely need something a little bit more comfortable than Marcel's bed or his couch. Does this mean that you're sleeping on the couch, honey? <laughs> <laughs> oh, Rick, you're so funny. Anyways, come in, you guys, come in, come in. Let's get you all settled. There's a lot of people here that want to see you. Oh, fantastic. It's been so long since we've seen all of you. Oh, oh, it's the baby. Quick, call a doctor. Call an ambulance. The baby's coming. Oh, well, that was a hard kick. Our little bundle here sure is active. So the baby's not coming? No, not today. Not for a while yet. Oh, for a second there, I thought things were going to get really exciting. Yeah. No, unfortunately, I'm not due for quite a while yet. And I'm okay with that. All right, guys, let's let them come in and just relax for a little bit. Lizzie, you must be tired. Come to the living room. Sit down. Oh, thank you, Rick. Yes, I am a bit tired. Oh, this is much better. Thank you. Even though I've been in the car, it's still nice to put my feet up after standing for just a short bit. Yeah, I know what that's like. Making a baby's hard work. So, Uncle Amazon John, you got any cool stories to tell us about the Amazon and the animals? Uh, not really, Johnny. We've been taking things kind of easy lately. 
Especially with Lizzie and the baby. You know, not too much exploring going on. Oh my gosh, you guys are gonna have the cutest baby. <gasps> have you thought of names yet? Baby Amazon John. That's the best name ever. Yeah, you gotta name the baby that. Oh, um, well, we're still thinking about names. My father keeps telling me that we need to name the baby after my maiden name. But somehow I don't think that Worcestershire Ricardo sounds like a good name for a child. So, not sure yet. And also, we don't know whether it's going to be a boy or a girl yet. We wanted to keep it a surprise. Yeah, either way, as long as it's healthy, we're happy. If you had a girl, you could name her Jasmine. Well, did you know, Jasmine, that that is my favorite flower? I love the smell of Jasmine in the morning. So, maybe. Okay, guys, don't ask too many questions. They're tired. They're just traveling. It's all right, Lucy. They're just inquisitive. Any good explorer asks a question. Hey, are you guys hungry? Oh, I better get your bags from the car to put in our room. Come on, son. Help a father out. But, but I have more questions. Come on, come help me. You can ask some more questions later. Your mom's right. They need to rest a little bit. You too, Jasmine. You can help as well. What? But the bags will be heavy. Which is why I need help, please. Okay, only because you're so nice, Dad. <laughs> wow, look at Jasmine. We get company and Dad has manners. Watch it, Johnny. Watch it. Uh, right, Dad. Bags. Come on, Jasmine. Well, Jason's at work, Marcel's upstairs and the kids are upstairs, and Becky's upstairs as well. I'll go let them know that you're all here. And I'm not sure if George and Judy are back yet. I'll go check if they're home too. I hope you're up for lots of conversations. Oh, John. I don't know if we should stay here, John. I feel awful. Taking Rick and Lucy's bed, maybe we should just go. It'll be fine, honey, come on. It's an adventure. Besides, you know how much fun it is staying here. Yes, you're right about that. It is quite fun, but I don't know. Besides, there's lots of people here to wait on you hand and foot while you're pregnant. Well, I don't know if I need to be waited on hand and foot, but your brother is a fantastic cook. Yes, he is. Uncle Amazon John! Aunt Lizzie! So happy to see you! Uh huh! We're animals! Oh, hello! Grace, Gabe, Addie, and Maddie. Hiya, kids! Whoa, you've all grown so much! <laughs> we big now! We go to school! Uh huh, but like Maddie said, we're animals from Amazon! Did you bring any? Ooh, ooh, me wanna see a monkey! <laughs> Hey, that was a pretty good impression, Maddie. Unfortunately, though, I left the animals where they belong. In the Amazon. Besides, I don't think your father could stand it if we brought any more things into this house. Oh, good thing we didn't bring Mortimer. <gasps> Aw, me wants a giant lizard. I know, but he had to stay home. Yep, definitely no room for him on the airplane. What new? Any new stories? Well, there was the time I got caught in the rabbit hole. Ooh, ooh, tell that one. Uh-huh, what happened? <gasps> Not the bunny. The bunny okay? Oh, the bunny was fine. He just didn't like that my foot was stuck in his house. Can't really blame him. <gasps> How do you get out? Well, the usual way. I yelled, Lizzie! And then I came with a shovel. <laughs> yep, because we make good partners. <laughs> Funny story. Silly Uncle Amazon John. <laughs> okay, well, I checked in on Becky and she's sleeping. So maybe you guys can visit her in a little bit? Of course. Don't want to wake her. And I see the kids came to say hello. Uh-huh. Uncle Amazon John got foot stuck in a rabbit hole. Then Lizzie had to come and save him. Goodness, sounds like a very exciting story. <laughs> Not really. Just one of the silly ones. Actually, Lucy, would you mind if I lay down for a little bit? Oh, I'm feeling a bit tired. Actually, you know what? I could have a little snooze too. Of course. Sorry, I should have asked. Yes, you must be very tired from your travels. Well, let's get you all set up. All right, well, the sheets are clean and the bathroom's down there. Make yourselves at home. It's lovely, Lucy. Thank you. Yeah, thanks, Luce. You're the best. <coughs> oh, oh. Hiya, Cupcake. <coughs> and hello, Licorice. All right, Cupcake and Licorice, come on. Let's let them get some sleep, okay? <coughs> Ooh, nap time. Oh, they're in here already. Rick. Yeah, what's up? What are you doing in here? They're sleeping. I know, I just, I gotta go to the bathroom. Well, use another bathroom. I was gonna use the kids, but Johnny's in there and we had spicy tacos last night. You know what that does to him. Then use your mom and George's. Let them sleep, they're so tired. Okay, okay. Shh, okay. Wash, 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 wash. Oh, I feel so much better. Oh, sorry, George. Rick, my boy. What can I do you for? Would you mind if I... Woo! 
That's a little ripe there, George. <laughs> Rick, my boy, you are a comical character. Did you need something? Uh, yeah, I needed to use the washroom. Do you mind if I go in here? All the other washrooms are full. Of course. Help yourself. <laughs> oh, I need some fresh air. <sighs> oh, that's better. <laughs> ah! Oh, hey, Dad. Marcel? What are you doing there when George was just there? You're there. George was there. What is going on? Oh, Dad, it was horrible. Start from the beginning. Why were you hiding in the tub? I wasn't hiding in the tub. I came to see if I could sleep in the tub. What? Why are you sleeping in the tub? I told you, sleep with Johnny and Jasmine. Yeah, exactly. I don't want to have to sleep with Johnny. Well, it's not like you're in his bed with him. There are air mattresses. Ugh, I know. Anyways, tub, keep going. Well, I just came in here to see how comfortable it was. And I laid down, and then before I knew it, George came in, and I was gonna pop up, but then, but then, then I heard noises, Dad. Farting noises. <laughs> Well, why didn't you pop up and just say, hey, I'm uh, in here occupied? It was too late by then. I thought, okay, I'll just sit here. It can't be that bad. He'll be done, and then that's it. He'll move on. But he didn't move on, Dad. It got worse, and then the smell hit me. The smell. I tried to breathe through my shirt. It didn't help. I think I got to burn these clothes, Dad. <laughs> Next time, just pop a hand up or something and just say, I'm in here, okay? No more trying to sleep in the tub, all right? All right. I don't want to do that again, so I think I'll be fine staying in Johnny and Jasmine's room. Sounds good to me. Now, uh, if you don't mind, buddy, I uh, I gotta go. Oh, where are you going? No, I mean, I gotta go. Oh, right. Uh, sorry, Dad. Okay. Okay. Honey, are you done? I gotta go. Oh, honey. Oh, I told you you shouldn't have eaten those spicy tacos yesterday. Oh, whew, that's ripe. Go try the kids' bathroom. What? No, honey, it's not me. I swear it was George. It was George. Ask Marcel. Oh, man. Oh, another day in bed. Come in. Aunt Lizzie, Uncle Amazon John. Hello, Becky. Hey, Becky. I heard you're pregnant. So am I. I can see that. It's so good to see you. I'm sorry that I didn't come down to see you sooner. I'm stuck in bed, and to be honest, I was a little bit tired. Don't need to apologize at all. Besides, we had a little bit of a nap ourselves. Yes, dreadfully tired from the traveling. It is so good to see you guys. It's been way too long. Indeed. Well, congratulations on your baby. Thank you. Yeah, we just found out that we're having a boy. Oh, how fantastic. We're going to keep it a surprise. I'm not sure what we're having. Well, whatever it is, it's going to be an adventurer. Oh, I hope so. Are you keeping it a surprise? Yeah, we were trying to do that, but it didn't really work out. I just needed to know. I know what that's like, but tell myself, no, I want it to be a surprise. Yep, makes it more exciting for us. Oh, here you guys are. I saw that you were up from your nap. I was just coming to check on Becky. How you doing, honey? Can dad get you anything? Are you hungry? Oh, dad, actually, you know what? I am hungry. I really want some ice cream and pickles. Yep, that's what I'm wanting. Oh, pregnancy craving. Oh, actually, Rick, would you mind making that too? That sounds delicious. Hey, uh, better make that three, buddy. I think I'd like to try that too. Okay, three pickle ice creams it is. I love my family, I love my family, love my family. Isn't my dad just the best? Your whole family is the best. We always have so much fun when we stay here to visit. Yep, there's no place like family. Hey, Rick. Yeah, John? Well, uh, I just want to say thanks. I know you got your hands full with Becky and the kids and everything else, and then we come along, but you know, I really wouldn't want to stay anywhere but with you. Don't get to see you as much as I'd like to. You know what, John? Yeah, I'm really happy that you're here too. You're right, we don't get to see each other enough. So I just want to say thanks, and I'm a little bit nervous. Why? What do you have to be nervous about? Uh, baby Amazon John, I'm gonna be a dad. Yeah? You're gonna be a great dad. I don't know. I wanna be, I wanna be a good dad like you. You're an amazing dad. I just don't know if I know how to be that. You'll be an amazing dad no matter what. You just be you. You're amazing. You're Amazon John. 
wrestle crocodiles or snakes or something. You live in the Amazon. You have adventures every day. You're gonna be great. You know how to handle any tricky situations. Yeah, I kind of do. It's different with a kid though. I just hope the little guy or girl loves me. They'll love you, just like we all love you. It's good to have you here, John. Thanks, Rick. It's good to be here. Old Amazon John wouldn't want to be anywhere else. <laughs> hey, are you making some of Dad's toast? Uh, yeah, I was making some for myself. Oh, sounds delicious. Yeah, I'll have some of that too. Thanks, Rick. <sighs> First he takes my bed, now he's taking my toast. I love my family. I really do love my family. The end. Thanks for watching. To join all the fun up in our treetop, please subscribe to Little Monkey Media's channel. Don't forget, if you like our video, please share it and click like. We go bananas for monkeying around! <laughs> click the Little Monkey logo to go to our channel page. Click on videos to watch them all.